poison ivy, poison oak, and poison sumac plant to contain a substance called urushiol, which triggers a type 4 cell-mediated hypersensitivity reaction and those who come into contact with it. Contact dermatitis occurs when the urushiol reacts to normal skin proteins. Patients will often present with papulovesicular lesions, which are raised red bumps that may develop into blisters. Severe pruritus or itching is also a common symptom that can significantly impact the patient's quality of life. As nurses, our role is to alleviate discomfort and promote healing. The first step is to cleanse the affected area immediately to remove any remaining plant oils. To relieve itching, apply cool, wet compresses to soothe and provide temporary relief to the inflamed area. There are a variety of treatment options. Burrows or dome burrow solution compresses, as well as a vino bass, are effective in relieving overall discomfort. Calamine lotion can also help relieve discomfort. Topical corticosteroids play an important role in managing inflammation. When used preemptively, they can prevent or reduce inflammation onset, especially if applied before blisters form. Oral corticosteroids, accompanied by diphenhydramine, may also be prescribed to provide relief and promote restful sleep. In severe cases, topical or oral glucocorticoids may be prescribed by the provider. These medications are stronger and can more effectively manage symptoms. Thank you for watching and let me know in the comments if you have any questions.